In this video, I'm going to show you how to use this Arcos 32 internet tablet and connect it to a TV. But I want to um, tell people that this this is a Generation 8 Arcos model, but it will not work with the 28 model, which does not output to a TV, or the 43 or 70 or 101 models because they use an HDMI connection. And this is using a cable that uses a composite connection, like um, RCA, yellow, white, and red jacks. Now, before you hook it up to the TV, you have to switch it, to tell it what kind of TV format you have. So, you have to plug in the cord. I'll show you later which cords to use. So I'm plugging the plug in just the one end in into the Arcos. Not going to plug it into the TV yet. All right now the things now you can select the switch to TV or TV format options. So I'm going to pick TV format. It says set, set the picture format. And then they give you several choices here. They got NTSC 43, NTSC 69, and Sometimes they'll have PAL on here. It looks like this time it doesn't show PAL. If you're in North America, you choose NTSC, and if you're in Europe, you choose PAL. And then I think other places, sometimes they use NTSC, and other times they use PAL. And 4.3 and 16.9, the difference is one's for full screen. Or old style TV sets and 69s for widescreen. Since I'm going to be using a widescreen TV, I, I'm putting it on 69. And now I'm going to get out of that. This is the kind of cable that you should try to use. It's got like a headphone type jack on the one end, and on the other end, you got the all white and red. I got this one out of the WD TV Live Plus machine that I also own, and I thought it would work if you just plugged in the video in the yellow and the audio into the white and red ones on the TV. Well, I found out after doing some research that the reason why it wasn't working is that for some reason Arcos the video comes through the red jack instead which is usually for audio so if you plug this one into the yellow jack then you'll get video with the WD with this cable that comes with the WD TV Live Plus machine and then the yellow one goes into the red jack I believe or no the white jack a white audio jack and then the white one goes into the red audio jack if I remember correctly so that's how you can use this cable to get a picture or get video from your Arcos 32 on the TV. Now I got the video plugged in to the video and audio cable ends plugged in to the TV. Remember I used red for video instead of yellow. And here is my um, Arcos 32 here. So now I'm going to um, pick the option here, switch to TV. Oop, I pushed the wrong one. Switch to TV here. Right now it's going to come on. See, there it is on the TV now. So now you can do just about anything that you can do on the Arcos 32 on the TV now. So, so let me see if I can maneuver this thing around here a little bit. Alright, I'm switching to different screens. Alright, here's... I'm going to show you the game here. If I can get it over there. Oops, I went into Google. Alright, I got into the keyboard thing. Right there, I'm going to try the game now. Here's the game that they preloaded on it. Now it's asking for sound, if, if I want sound. Or, now the game's loading. And I should mention that on this thing, in order to move the th 
mouse or the, it's got like a mouse cursor you just use this like a you know just move it around with your finger like a touchpad type thing and see I want to start the game here I'm in the instructions I gotta go back do you want to exit the game it's asking me I said I want to put down no okay now I'm gonna start the race here's the racing game you just use this thing you know you just kinda of turn the steer kinda of cool got pretty good graphics as you can see you just turn this to steer so you know so it's kinda of neat to be able to do it on your TV on a bigger screen than on the, just the Arcos 32 thing here okay now I'm gonna show a video being played on it through the TV here through this TV here so I go up to the video I want and click on it. This is one of the videos I've previously made, so you should recognize it. And this is my title screen here. So it's kind of nice to be able, once again, to watch it on the big screen. And we should be able to see the Washington State thing here. Yeah. So it works pretty good on TV, depending on what video format you're using. Now I had a problem with using this cable here with the WDTV Live Plus, and that is that I also use it for WDTV Live Plus. So in order to use it for my Arcos, I would have to unplug it from the WDTV Live Plus. Well, it turns out after doing some more digging that this other cable that's provided with the WDTV Live Plus, that's for component video with the kind of blue, green, and red RCA type ends and the one 3.5 inch headphone type one. I think it's 3.5 inch. I'm not sure on that. Or, well, actually, I think it's 3.5 millimeter, something like that. And I tried plugging this one in after I heard that this one can work like a um, composite cable and you use this one red one again for video and the blue and green ones are for audio and it will work with Arco 32 using this cable as well so I use um, HDMI video for the WDTV live now and then I use this one of course for the audio because I don't have my TV don't have HDMI audio input on it, so I have to use this one for the audio. Now you're probably wondering if you can use these like coupler things with the female end on both end. They're really short with the female end on both end for RCA to extend the cord, and the answer is yes. But I noticed that, remember the red one is video for the, for the Arcos. But when you use another cable to extend it, you use the regular video, which would be yellow. And then you plug that the other yellow end into the TV's input jack. Video input jack. And then the same thing with the audio, you just use the regular audio for the extension. When you're plugging it into the extension thing, just use the audio, the regular audio color that's into the TV instead of the one that the Arcos is using. Now you're probably wondering if there's another way to connect it to the TV without if you don't have a WDTV Live Plus and I'm happy to report the answer is yes. Just by using this one little adapter thing, it's like a headphone adapter into two RCA audio jacks here. If you plug it in like this and then plug the other red and white one into the TV, it'll work. However, there's a one little problem with using it this way and you can't and that is you can't have the the headphone part in all the way you got to kind of leave it out a little bit so you kind of lose the video at times but it does work I'm switching to the TV to show you that it works here I can get to switch the TV here right now it doesn't want to work Okay, I'm showing here now that it does work. 
I would recommend in order to get to work this way with with these kind of cables or adapters is you got to put it in all the way into the headphone jack and then select switch to TV because if you don't have it in far enough it doesn't um, recognize it and then you just pull it out just a teeny bit until your picture comes on but the problem with using this kind of cable or adapter these kind of cables and adapters is that they easily lose the signal like they did right there so you can't do a lot of movement or you lose the picture but it does work and right, now I'm going to do the same thing with this um, cable with the yellow or not yellow white and red audio ends on one end and uh, headphone headphone input jack on the other end and show you that this one will work too so again using this cable I plug the red end into the yellow video end on the input on the TV so remember red is video and white is audio and then here's the screen and here's the things so yeah it's out a little ways this one works a little better it's got a better fit so you can move it around without losing the picture so you know so you, chances are you probably have one of these cables around if you have like some type of headphones or audio devices or something so there are ways of getting a picture on the Arcos onto your TV without spending a whole lot of money.